Hi, welcome to this video. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate quick stuff regarding sketch.io. Once you're connected to internet, you can type https colon slash slash sketch.io slash sketchpad slash enter. I'll be providing the link down in the video as well as in the description. So it's pretty nice tool which you can use for demonstration and do some basic animation or image processing stuff. So getting back to this tool and this is how it looks like once you launched. This three bars will give you more room once you click it. This side you can see an about. Click on it will take you down to the help screen and other features of this tool. Anyway I'm not interested to show that in this because you can easily follow tools in this video else you can also go through that as a recommended process and coming back to this I want to expand this black color column which will give more settings for each and every tool that we are going to select over here first one is the select and this yellow triangle over here will be providing more details like the types of the select similarly for every tool you might find some hidden information under that menu this is a pen, a pencil, a marker, or some other stuff is provided over here. And the third one is choosing shapes. There are tons of shapes over here. The moment I click, you can see on left this column all the other options are provided. This is the clip art. Same stuff. You can choose the different animals, plants, or people. For example, the people is selected. You can click on one and tap on it. Just you can even do or multiple copies as well as you can shape twist and turn and if you want to select everything you can do this select tool drag it on all and click delete from your keyboard and everything will be vanished this can also be done using control a which will select everything and control z or delete the alternate way is to do this undo button which is there on top right anyway i'm going to go with each and everything and different options in this tool to start with, I'm going with text. The moment I click, you see the options are provided over here. Handwriting, I'm choosing. Out of all this, handwriting is the one I have chosen. This has submenus like Aladdin and other stuff. I'm going with Aladdin. Click on any one part and you can type name. Kiran welcomes you for this training. So if you want to enter, this is how it looks like. But you can do even a lot of other stuff for example if i want to change the font size to be less you can go for the opacity how it should be appearing on the screen so you can click on the next so whatever you do even i want to change the color to blue so the moment you click it change information i'm not sure whether you are going to do it let me zoom in to show all the new stuff and you can also go with the gradient for your next stuff choosing some other stuff how is this so this is under gradient so I even I want to increase the size of it feel the gradient so this is somewhat you have experienced with your um, market tool and other stuff so I'm just going to select everything and delete as I mentioned earlier the next one is the pencil tool this is the default you can also have a similar stuff for example in the settings you can go for other fill color and um, this is going for the basic size this is too big so let me go back and I want to go with a somewhat a reddish color so this is how the free scribble looks like you can do that you can make circles a square or an arrow you want to change it to blue you can do the same but there is a different, for example, if you choose the drop down, you're having a lot of other options like the pen tool. For this, you can increase the size to see how it looks like. Or you go with calligraphy, somewhat closer. Choose the crayons. Before doing that, I just want to clear up everything. The crayons are real nice and helpful for other people who are kids. So I'm going with some tree animation over here. And if I want to go with some greenish color, I can do that. So this is a quick tree. If you want to go with some mountains, you can go like this. 
you want to avoid sun you do that with little bit of orangey color inside you can do that so this is how it looks like the sun and other features so that's the crayon style you can choose for different options over here like the stamp arrow it gives a very good animation for example if I'm choosing something like blue and do that so this is very much helpful for doing other stuff and let's explore these objects over here choosing the shape for example this is a square this is some other thing and if I change the color you can better observe the other stuff so with these shapes you can do a lot of other stuff and it also comes with a lot of patterns you can choose different patterns and get some nice objects over there you can also choose the radiant burst and with the patterns I'm not able to see much so let's go with the gradient and you can see a very good animation in this recording stuff going for the clip art there are tons of features over here Prior to going there, I just want to select delete everything, going choosing the clip art, I'm going to choose this. And this is a cute little cat. Let us choose another one. And this is a different stuff. You can do that in any angle you want it to. Clip arts are really nice. Not only animals, you can go for the people. You can do that selecting Chinese lady or here I want to choose yes one more lady so you can put on a lot of stories on top of your drawing with already built in clip art so here the next one I want to demonstrate is the fill if you click and do anywhere you'll see based on the gradient this will be the stuff coming for example multicolor gradient on top of that if you want to make some pencil related stuff for example I want to make something like this and I want to fill this time with a hard fill to some color gradient maybe it's not properly closed so it couldn't be the one which I made it so let me get it so these are some of the stuff so let me select everything delete I want to use a pencil, a circle, this time I can show it much better the color. This is the fill. At the last, you can use eraser to erase all the other stuff. You use undo over here or control Z doing the same operations. So this is how you can control. If you want to do a opacity part, you can do that. This is with full opacity, not 30 d and these are the things you can also do some blending operations lining on top of it so i hope you enjoy doing a lot of stuff over here the spacing the line width you can change multiple stuff and see things are working for you i hope this online tool really helped a lot and before closing everything, I just want to go with a simple demonstration like I want to do use a pen and demonstrate something. So let me choose a black color which is worthwhile. A plus B whole square which is equal to. I just want to go with a less facing for the answer part so I can go with sizing less. You can say a square plus b square plus 2ab and if you want to do some arrow marks you can do that with proper coloring this is how it looks like the demonstration is really cool over here you can go with crayons paint it and get the attraction of the viewer thanks for watching this video before uh, going further, I just wanted to give you uh, some more things like you can save it, click on save, download, choose some option like JPEG, size, default, web, for example if you want to go for the track printing and click on download, that should download the stuff over here. 
and if you want to use it a new one click on new click new and the dimensions over here create and that does but the old one is still existing if you want to do anything you can still do on it or if you want to permanently delete click delete and say yes it's still there in the memory the moment you click on the new one it goes and these are some of the operations that you can do you can click on history stunts of features over there so even for the online this is real nice for your demonstration thanks for watching this video stay tuned for more videos this is Kiran signing off have a good day bye, -bye.